celebrities like Natalie Portman. On top of it. It's OK. Tyra Banks. And I got supermodels for you, too, if you want to, like, date any of those girls. <laughs> and Jeff Goldblum. I like all your, uh, all your uh, gestures. Have tried to beat the heat on the hugely popular weekly web series, Hot Ones. I was fascinated by interview shows in general. Like, it's the oldest construct in media. Producer Chris Schoenberger and host Sean Evans created the show. When he approached me, he's like, hey, what do you think about a show where we interview celebrities while eating violently hot chicken wings? Oh, 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 oh that's terrible. We didn't really expect hot sauce to break down people the way that it does. Very impressive. Thanks. I mean, it's spicy, but... I'm just trying to read your eyes on that. It's hot. <laughs> I think yeah. the mechanics of the show are just this one big trust exercise with Sean. <laughs> there have been times where I'm looking across the table and I'm like, this person is up against the ropes. Like, I don't even know if they're going to make it. I need some ice cream, mama. And at about 3 million views per episode, Hot Ones shows no signs of cooling off. Michelle, you'll be on this side. OK. I even side. took a turn in the hot seat. So you go from mile to double X. Yeah. We're doing five wings, and it gets hot here in a hurry. Cheers. Cheers. What are the tips you give to folks on how to handle all this hotness? So <clears throat> this is the real problem with hot sauce, is there's nowhere to go. There's nowhere to <sighs> run. I could... The popularity of hot ones may partly be due to our changing tastes. Hot sauce sales are increasing faster than any other condiment, and the total hot sauce market is approaching $2 billion a year. And the source of some of the most intense heat is in this field in South Carolina. You're with the what company? The Pucker Butt Pepper Company. Smokin' Ed Curry is the founder of this creatively named pepper company 95 countries get our products on a regular basis. And he thinks his product is downright addictive. When you eat super hot peppers, and you get, you get a endorphin rush. He's not just blowing smoke. A compound in chilies called capsaicin fools us into thinking our bodies are burning, prompting the release of pain-relieving endorphins, producing a natural high. You know, I might have been catching a little buzz <laughs> eating peppers. Uh, and he's spreading that buzz through his prize pepper, the fearsome Carolina Reaper, currently ranked as the hottest pepper in the world, around 1,000 times hotter than a jalapeno. When we cut one in half, see all that oil in there, the glistening? Yes. That's what hurts oh. you. Cheers. Then, of course, he wanted to share. You notice how it's hotter right away? That's the oil <laughs> reacting with the receptors. Have the endorphins kicked in yet? Yeah, probably starting right now. <coughs> they never did. Things I do for my job. Do you want to hit me? Uh. That hurt? No. 